was medieval. Our scores, David's on 23, JD is on 38 as we head into our final games of the night. And of course, we're starting with a letters game. David, what would you like this time? Uh, constant, please, Lily. Thanks, David. N. And a vowel, please. O. And another vowel, please. U. And one more vowel. A. And a consonant, please. T. And another consonant, please. D. And another consonant, please. N. And one more consonant. R. And another vowel. And last letter, E. And here's the clock. Letters game of the night, David. How did you go on that one? How many? I'll go on an eight. Oh, that sounds great. Jody? I only had a seven. That's well, a seven is actually very nice, but uh, let's hear it anyway. Donator. And yours, David? Endurant. Endurant. Now, there is a slightly challenging word, David. I can see you reaching for the dictionary. Enduring. Enduro, the long distance race. No endurance, I'm afraid, David. Uh, worth a punt, but uh, didn't pay off. Now, donator. Hopefully. Donate, donator. O R Jody. Um, and the head word listing on here is doozy. So you both went for doozies, <laughs> but unfortunately the doozies backfired. What did you find? Look, uh, I was looking at uh, atoned and thinking unatoned. I just wasn't confident in the time, and in the end, launched on rotunda for a seven. Rotunda. Oh, that's a lovely word. That's a lovely word. Very nice indeed. <laughs> Unfortunately, though, no score in that round for either David or Jody. 23 for David. Jody still on 38. Let's go to our final numbers game for tonight now. And uh, Jody, what would you like to choose? Can I have one large and five small? Thanks, Lily. Thank you, Jody. One large and five small. And the last numbers lot for today: six, nine, one. Five, eight, and the large number is 25. And the target treat is 194. Thanks, Lily. Let's see if we can get there. go with that one? Uh, 194. Spot on the target, well done. And you too, David? Also 194. All right. Well, uh, Jody, take us through your approach, please. Uh, 25 by the 8 is 200. 25 by 8 is 200. And minus the 6 gives you 194. Subtract the 6 is 194. Very nice indeed. Um, David, can we assume you did the same? Same one again. If you could just verify. I presume that's... Uh, the best and simplest method? Exactly the same way. And I presume that you got the same answer as uh, well? Well, I did, actually, yes. <laughs> great relief, great relief. It's been an educational program for me. Thank you, Lily. And ten points each for David and Jody. That means that our score is now 33 for David, 48 points for Jody. So it's time for that final round. It is conundrum time. Let's reveal tonight's conundrum. Your time starts now. Unfortunately, no sound of a buzzer within the 30 seconds. Let's have a look 
at the conundrum solution, and it is adversity, which may describe the situation at the moment with no buzzers sounding. But that means with the scores unchanged after the final round, the winner tonight is Jody. <laughs> But very well played, David, and uh, on your wedding anniversary, uh, a great a great game. Well done. Thank you. And a Macquarie Dictionary, of course, to take home with you. Thank you very much. And Jodie, we'll see you tomorrow night. Yes. Look forward to that. Well played. Thank you. David, uh, we had a little bit of um, animal words tonight. <laughs> we did. I'll throw you one more, and that is, uh, we've borrowed it from the German, and it's earworm. And so those really stupid, uh, catchy songs that get in your ear and you cannot get them out. So that's an earworm. Ooh, sounds very unpleasant, <laughs> but very interesting. <laughs> see you tomorrow night, see David. And uh, see you tomorrow night, Lily. Yes, see you tomorrow. And remember, you can do it. Ooh, and occasionally tonight I did, much to my relief. Thank you, Lily. And thank you for being with us this evening. We will be back with you tomorrow night at the same time. We'll do it all again then. Six o'clock. Good night.